Hey everyone, today I um, decided to make a video for the Oscar winners um, from last night's Academy Awards show. Now, originally I was going to upload my reactions to the winners, but apparently I've had some technical difficulties with that because um, I did a show on Blog TV with that and of course it kind of got screwed up so um sorry about that for those who tuned in to watch that and um so i'm just gonna announce all the winners of all the categories and i mean every single one and i might just say like who i wish could have won but um we'll see all right so um i'm reading a list off of the yahoo um, movies uh, website and uh, let's see so for cinematography um, which is the award that Tom Hanks had presented and um, it was Hugo um, Robert Richardson for Hugo and as well as art direction um, Dante Ferretti and Francesco Lo Schiavo um, also for Hugo and then um, costume design Mark Bridges for the artist I think that's a really good choice because um, I really like the uh, sort of 1920s style costumes and um, makeup. Now this one I was kind of surprised but not too surprised. I was hoping for something other than the Iron Lady which had won um, so yay for that and um, as well as one that was definitely expected to win so there's no surprise here for the foreign language film for a separation um, so there was a lot of talk about that winning so it won so I'm glad about that um, and also the big award one of the biggest awards of the night um, that I was really happy about and one of which was because of who was presenting this award and it was Christian Bale who was presenting for best supporting actress and I knew hands down who I wanted to win so I'm really glad that Octavia Spencer won because Man, that girl is like serious inspiration to a lot of people, and she looked really pretty in um, her dress. So I really like that, and I loved her in The Help. She was definitely hilarious, definitely one of my top favorites. Um, and on to film editing, which I originally um, wasn't sure who was going to win this, but I'm really glad that um, The Girl with the Dragon Tattoo won for this. So. Um, that was for film editing and then sound editing as well as sound mixing went to Hugo so there's no surprise there and then um, but I'm kinda of wishing that Girl with Dragon Tattoo won for um, some of those awards and now on to a documentary feature now I had heard that there was this really good um, documentary about um, some kids I don't remember what the name of it was but the real winner is Undefeated, which was about football team. And then um, there were only a couple nominations for this next category, which was for Best Animated Feature. And, of course, wasn't too many choices, but it went to Rango, so no surprise there, once again. And um, for visual effects, um, if you haven't guessed it, it was for Hugo. Um, so I was kind of hoping maybe for something else, but there's no surprise that Hugo won. And, you know, Hugo's won a lot of the visual sound awards, so, um, no surprise there. And, uh, for Best Supporting Actor, um, went to Christopher Plummer for, um, his role in Beginners, so I'm really happy about that. It's no surprise. Um, I was kind of hoping that, um, either, uh, I was hoping uh, Nick Nolte would win, I think, right? Yeah. Um, Nick Nolte won for that movie for um, his role in Warrior, because I saw that and it was really good. But, oh well. And um, original score, of course, went to The Artist. And um, original song. And there were only a couple choices here, too. So, um, Man or Muppet from... The Muppets, so I'm really happy about that because that was a pretty interesting movie. Um, adapted screenplay went to The Descendants, and original screenplay went to Midnight in Paris, and those two movies I want to see, 
but I haven't seen yet, so I don't know if they're good or not. And um, live action short, I'm not familiar with any of these except I ended up voting for one of these on um, some poll online and the shore one for live action short and a documentary short was Saving Face. Um, I was kind of rooting for that one too, um, even though I hadn't seen it. So um, animated short went to the Fantastic Flying, this, this is what I call the mouthful, the Fantastic Flying Books of Mr. Morris Lesmore, um, which I haven't seen. And um, now the final four categories of the night, which, um, you know, is anybody's game, but is also anybody's guess. Um, best director, I was hoping that it would go to um, either Martin Scorsese for um, Hugo, but it went to, uh, I can't, Sorry if I pronounce his name wrong. Michelle Hazana Vicious. I think that's how you say his name. Um, for the artist. Um, and also best actor, which I was hoping would go to Gary Oldman for Tinker Tailor Soldier Spy, cause big fan of his, and he's never won an Oscar in his life. Um, for his long acting career, I'm really surprised. That, I mean, thank God he got nominated, but it would have been nice if he won. So this award went to Jean Dujardin for the artist. Um, and then, of course, this was actually a big surprise. Now I'm starting to think that the Oscars love this person. The Academy loves Meryl Streep. She won for Best Actress for her role in The Iron Lady. I'm not surprised. I'm kind of wishing that it went to Viola Davis for The Help. I saw that movie. I thought it was really good. Her role was fantastic in that. I think, um, I mean, despite having uh, Meryl Streep be nominated, like, 17 times, I think, and she's only won, I don't know how many times, but I think the Academy just sucks up to Meryl Streep. Like, they just, they can't stop, you know, picking her for awards, so, I don't know. It was kind of sad. But, um, Best Picture, the last final award of the night, it's not really surprising, but I'm gonna say this, the artist won for Best Picture, and I was really hoping that it would be the help, because I didn't see the artist, and I think, you know, it's a typical, it's a no-brainer for the Academy to pick something artistic. So they definitely, I don't know, I feel like they made a big mistake there. But, I mean, I'm happy that it won. I mean, it deserves it. Any of these um, movies deserved it. And, um, yeah. So just let me know in the comments um, what you guys thought of the Academy Awards, if you saw it last night. And um, if there were any... Um, actors or actresses that got snubbed that you wish um, were nominated um, for any of the awards and um, any for the anyone for the category sorry and um, if uh, you liked that the artist won or you would have preferred another movie to win um, for best picture and um, as always you guys can subscribe to my channel I've got movie reviews movie updates and come back every week for my show the Thursday videos and you guys can also Follow me on Twitter and like me on Facebook, and I will see you guys later. Bye.